Astros go up against the Texas Rangers. Framber Valdez is a favorite on the road at about minus 170. Lower total, though, 7.5 here. Whenever I see the Astros involved in a 7.5, I get interested. Then I remember they're the under team of the decade. What do we think yeah. here between Texas and Houston? Yeah, underplays again in this game, too. Take a look at this. Framber yeah. Valdez, the left-handed pitcher on the mound for the Astros over the past month in Major League Baseball. 3.6 x fifth number. K percentage over 20%. But his splits are outrageous to lefties. Keep in mind, again, Valdez is a left-handed pitcher. 19 batters, a 145 weighted on base percentage, and an ISO of zero. So you figure something has to give, Kevin, right? Left-handed pitcher going up against right-handed batters, which he's going to face a lot of tonight. 91 right-handed batters he's faced over the past month in Major League Baseball. 287 weighted on base percentage in an ISO of 086. He's really holding it down. Should do the same. Now, Dunning isn't a great pitcher. A 4x fib, late K props. But take a look at this. He's been surviving, Kevin. Lefty batters he's faced 307 as a weighted on base percentage through 62 batters. Right-handed batters he's faced 54 of those, a 258 weighted on base percentage. And you're right. You look at the Houston Astros lineup. There's a lot of really nice names in there. But if you take a look against right-handed pitching over the past month, the only guys with ISO power numbers that are eligible Elevated, Bregman, Tucker, and Mancini. Everybody else has really struggled. So maybe we're looking at another under between Houston and the Astros. Or excuse me, Houston and the Rangers today. Gotcha. Something to certainly follow as well. The Valdez strikeout prop. It look, it looks like an under, but the juice at minus 122. Is it good enough? We'll see. Since the All-Star break, six outings for Valdez. Uh, he's gone over six and a half, four times, including once against these Texas Rangers, striking out eight batters. He's an interesting guy to follow on this board.